morning guys welcome back to raver's mead um so yeah i'm sick in case you can't notice from my ridiculous voice right now i will apologize in advance for any outbursts of coughing and spluttering that will likely occur through this video uh yeah but ba <laughs> basically this <clears throat> this morning is gonna be pretty rough because i feel pretty rough and at some point in the next half an hour i have got 50 bales of hay coming and i still haven't figured out where i'm gonna put them yet so that was a uh, good good pre-planning on my part um apologies again for the mess here everywhere guys we're kind of we're going through a big tidy up overhaul we've got stuff everywhere on the driveway at the moment um oh yeah we've got got some new water containers which is really cool i just need to finish off the drain piping for that so we're going to be able to gather a lot more rainwater with those uh oh yeah and there's something else new in the field that i don't know if i got in the shop yet but i'll show you that in a minute uh because i have some exciting news regarding that actually regarding mr blueser over there but yeah i think my hay's gonna have to go in here because well there's literally nowhere else to put it where it's under cover so i'm gonna have to drag those jump stands out in a minute um, it is only 50 bales, so it's not going to take up a ton of space. I'm pretty sure we've had like 200 in that space before. Maybe. Maybe 150. It might have been 150. I can't remember. We've had a lot more than 50 in here, so it'll definitely fit. Yeah. Um, the horses are just eating their breakfast. As soon as they're done, I'm going to take them straight down the field and get them out of the way. Because I need to swing all these gates open in a minute, so the guy who's bringing the hay has got room to come in. And turn around and unload and do his thing uh so yeah that's my morning this is going to be entertaining oh yeah the other thing i was going to show you while they're still eating uh this is this is awesome by the way da, da, da. that happened <laughs> we have a horse box we're back on the road we're back on the road blueberry good boy you finished your feet are awful at the moment Blue's feet have taken a turn for the worst this last couple of weeks and it's in the heat and the weather's been helping. Um, we went through a really wet spell and he got a little bit fungusy and then it got really dry and hot again. His feet just cracked and split. I've tied them up once but we have got the farrier coming this Friday so hopefully he can sort those out because mm, the week after, so not this weekend but the weekend after, uh, we're going to be taking Blue to a horse show. He's only going to be doing in hand because I feel like crap. There's no way in hell I'm going to be schooling a horse. I haven't really been schooling them for showing anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, I haven't really been schooling them for showing or going out anyway. I'll be honest, I kind of, you know, dropped the ball on that one. Can you not be trusted to walk down with me? Because I really don't want to have to argue with all three of you on lead ropes. Let's try it. Uh, yes, yeah, so in hand only. Do you want to go out in the yard, Nelly? New. Oh, you're all stiff today, babe. What have you done to yourself? She's been looking really good the last couple of weeks and she's come out of her stable then, all stiff like an old lady. Oh, thank you for sharing your snot. Ew. That's disgusting. Bleh. I've had enough of snot the last couple of days. Blimey. Yeah, so in hand showing. We're going to be going to Barclay Show. I actually need to sort out entries for that today. Oh, I have such a great big list of things. Hey, can you not break your bucket? Come on. Come on. Good boy. Yeah, I need to I need to sort out the entries for that. I have so much to do today, it's ridiculous. And all I want to do is go and curl back up in my bed. Come on. Let's go, guys. I'm a little bit worried that Nanny Moo is still very stiff now couple of days she's looked absolutely fantastic so I don't know why but all of a sudden she's gone a bit hobbly again. Maybe she's been clowning around in the field with the others. I know Blue has been harassing her a little bit. I mean she's not been taking it. I'm not worried about her. She puts them in place. But there has been definite harassment. Come on guys! Come on! Let's go! 
My voice is ridiculous. Come on. Nelly. Come on. Yeah, they're not listening to me at all. This is a bad idea. Come on. Jeez, see, I lose my voice and I lose my authority. Oh, come on. Oh, blimey. See, this is how I know I'm really sick because my camera arm literally feels like it's going to drop off right now. Ha! Ah. Come on, bird. Yeah, I know. Come on. They're being naughty, aren't they? All right, off you go. Yeah, I'm going to shut her in for a minute. I'm going to go bring the boys down on the head collar. So I'm going to put you guys down somewhere and we shall resume this vlog shortly. Come on, fun, Taz. Oh. Well, the hay is here. Um, oh my goodness, I feel like death on legs right now. Um, being completely honest, that's just going to sit there for a few hours now. Uh, I lost the boys in the wrong field. Um, they just gave me grief on the way down and then uh, Stuart turned up with our hay, so I just left them because they were driving me crazy. So yeah, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go move the boys into the proper field, take the dice some water, and then I'm gonna go to Tesco's and buy some ice cream because my throat really hurts and I want ice cream. And then I'm gonna take a lot of painkillers and come back and deal with this in a couple of hours because right now, I'm over it, so I'll see you in a few hours, guys. Right, people. Oh, hey, my voice sounds a bit better now. Uh, yeah, I've slept probably the last four hours. I would estimate about four hours of snooze. I've eaten a whole box of ice creams, taken a lot of painkillers. I've uh, drank a lot of uh, honey and ginger tea. Yeah, pretty good. Oh, and I've, uh, I've covered my jumper in peppermint oil as well, which smells absolutely lovely right now. I'm just doing a very good job of keeping my sinuses clear. Uh, yeah, so, oh, I didn't think this through, I blocked the gateway. This, this big pile here, all has to go in there, which is full of stuff right now. So, um, do you know what? I'm just going to go cave woman and drag it all out and uh, shove the hay in and then I will deal with the consequences after because that's just how I'm feeling today. <laughs> Hey guys, it's the next day now. I still sound like crap. I still feel like crap. Um, but the hay is away. If you can see it over there. Oh, I'm probably going to have to get up to show you to be fair. But, uh... There we go. Oh. I don't even know if you can see that to be honest, but it's in there, I promise you. And um, I can't be bothered to walk over there right now. <laughs> this is just my vibe at the moment. <laughs> uh, yeah, hay's in. There's still stuff thrown all across the yard. Um, yeah. That happened, that didn't get put away last night. Um, I actually ended up, <coughs> ended up having help putting the hay away in the end. Cause I just, it wasn't happening. I just could not do it. And um, once we'd finished that, I pretty much just left everything else. I didn't even muck out yesterday. 
The horse has actually stayed out last night, which is why they're in now, which to be fair has worked out quite well. Um, it turns out we're due a really hot spell. <coughs> Excuse me. Turns out we're due a really hot spell over the next couple of weeks. So it actually worked out as pretty good timing to switch them onto nighttime grazing, uh, which is what we've done. So there, they stayed out all last night, but they're in today. Oh, Blue was over the door a minute ago. He had like proper, proper floppy lip syndrome, but he's gone back in now. Um, but yeah, they're all nice and cool, nice and chilled. Um, yeah, it was pretty much my day. I have so much stuff to do, and I think the likelihood of getting any of that stuff done again today, slim to nil. <coughs> the best bit is, so I've actually just had a week off work, um, which, you know, makes sense. Why wouldn't I get sick on my week off? Plus it was music festival week as well. So, you know, naturally I'm going to be sick for that, uh, which I was. Typical, typical me really. Yeah, I have, I have to go back to work tomorrow and I'm really worried that this is not going to be, <coughs> this is not going to be um, gone. It kind of feels like it's, uh, I don't know if getting worse is the right phrase, but it's definitely not getting any better. Um, I'm okay sat down now, but as soon as I get up and start walking around um, and I try to like start using my lungs, I am just coughing, spluttering. It's awful, really, really bad. Haven't been sleeping great either. Um, basically, if I lie down flat, I um I tend I, I'm getting this like build up of mucus and then I'll wake up in the middle of the night in an absolute choking fit. So that kind of scared the crap out of me a couple of times. <laughs> so I've been trying to sleep in a more upright position. I think the Victorians used to do that actually. Honestly the Victorians, maybe it was some other older historic group. I don't know. I just remember reading in a history book once that people used to sleep sitting up. I don't know, something along those lines. I'm probably waffling absolute crap on that one, but I was doing whatever they were doing. I've been trying to sleep sat up, right? And it doesn't do it for me. I've been not been getting a restful sleep at all. It's been really uncomfortable. The breathing's been really uncomfortable. So yeah, good week off. <laughs> Pretty standard. <coughs> yeah, that's, um, that's me done with whatever the heck this vlog turned out to be. I really didn't want to not shoot something this week because I keep having these like issues. Like I had an issue with my video editing software and then I had an issue with the cable that I got for my new camera. I just keep running into issues and I keep ending up like skipping a week or two of putting a video out and I really want to get out of the habit of doing that and get back into the habit of doing them every week or even like twice a week like I was before. But yeah. I've, I've powered through, made my vlog, it's pathetic, and I sound awful, but I shared some kind of interesting stuff. I mean, we got the new horse box. I'll, I'll do a proper video about that when I can actually talk properly. We've got the show coming up with Blue, so that's kind of exciting. I've actually got a video in mind I want to do about that, actually, about turnout for Gypsy Cobb, so that's going to be fun. But again, I need my voice back properly before I do that. <clears throat> yeah, tons of DIY stuff. Actually, I want to I wanna make some videos about skincare again as well. I've been experimenting with some things out of my garden. So, but yeah, I've, I've, I'm not going to waffle on about that. I'll save that for the video itself. But I've been doing some research into herbalism, natural remedies and stuff like that. And I found some really interesting stuff and I'm growing some of that stuff now, which is cool. But yeah, I've been sat here in this chair talking to you for way too long now guys you're probably bored out of your brains so i'm gonna wrap it up there and i'll see you in our next video when hopefully i sound a bit less pathetic and i can actually get up and move around and do stuff without you know choking and spluttering all over you so <laughs> thanks for hanging out with me bye <laughs>